Спасибо, мадам. So we'll start with the pigtail, which is just a short 10 to 25 foot section of trunk. <laughs> and what that does is when water tries to come back in, the ball will seal against the back of it and won't let water come back in. We use that a lot of times for uphill. Guys, since the bottom of it, I know I have enough in it to start it, so right there. So every time I pull, the pump's going to suck gas. Oh, you got that one? Okay. 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 Yeah. Yeah. talk about the mix on that uh, in a minute but um, it's cheap to operate it you know deep stuff flying your eyes you know so it's critical that you have all that all your PPE on biker cap on it just like a fuse right not that much not complicated not different um, as you can see burning the other thing you can do is come to a flat rock and bury it in that. Yeah. So this is why we don't do four to one oftentimes. It just doesn't want to burn that well. I can't hardly keep the fuse lit on this. So you can go and pop back over here. Hi, my name is Sergeant Brett Jenkins. I'm with Charlie Company, one of the 161 Infantry out of Washington State. Uh, today we're training with the Department of Natural Resources, getting firefighter training, what's called Red Card. Get us certified to uh, help out with wildfires throughout the state. Uh, so our day is just getting started, and we've gone over hose lay and dealing with water, how to get that out on a fire, how to suppress it, and roll it back up and move to the next, next uh, fire. And then we also learned how to use torches and uh, fuses, how to start fires when they're necessary for us. And then the next uh, following bit of training is going to be uh, how to dig a fire line, which is uh, what a majority of the firefighting work is, along with mop-up. In preparation for the summer months, uh, the Guard's been called out to help with fires before for the state, and we're just trying to stay ahead of the curve and stay as ready as we can. <laughs> 